My brothers and sisters, Bishop Cotter here. I'd like to share just a few words of the month of October as Respect Life Month and also the month of the Rosary. So it's definitely a month of prayer, kind of helping us to focus in these very uncertain times. And one of the great areas that we are challenged, the world is challenging us with us, is um, the respect of life and the dignity of life, the sanctity of life. It never ends. The battle continues. And I'd like to share with you during this month of October little excerpts from Living the Gospel of Life, a Challenge to American Catholics. This is a statement by the Catholic bishops of the United States. So I'd like to begin with the following quote, and then time for you to take that with you and kind of reflect on it as we move on to the next, as we uh, work our way through the month of October. So I begin with respect for the dignity of the human person demands a commitment to human rights across a broad spectrum. It's a huge spectrum, this aspect of respect life and dignity of life. Both as Americans and as followers of Christ, American Catholics must be committed to the defense of life, and that is in all its stages and in every condition. The culture of death, though, extends beyond our borders, beyond our, our shores. Famine and starvation, denial of health care, and development around the world, the deadly violence of armed conflict and the scandalous arms trade that spawns that conflict always threatens life. Our nation is witness to domestic, domestic violence, the spread of drugs, sexual activity which poses a threat to lives, and a reckless tampering with the world's ecological balance. Respect for human life calls us to, to defend life from these and many other threats. It calls us as well to enhance the conditions for human living by helping to provide food, shelter, and meaningful employment, for example, beginning with those who are most in need. We live the gospel of life when we live in solidarity with the poor of the world, that is, standing up for their lives and standing up for their dignity also as a human family. But brothers and sisters, Yet abortion and euthanasia have become preeminent threats to human dignity because they directly attack life, life itself, the most fundamental human good and the condition for all the others. My brothers and sisters, during this month of October, through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosaries, we pray our rosary, let us offer up this dignity of human life and especially the importance of that preeminent aspects of life that attack life, abortion and euthanasia. So let us pray in reparation for those sins and those with hardened hearts that need to come to the understanding and the love of Christ Jesus in the midst of the value and sanctity of human life in this day and age. May God bless you all. Let us be united in prayer during the month of October. God bless you all. Thank you.